All right, well, we're looking at a strong storm system moving through the central U.S. here today. It will bring us some severe weather. In fact, an enhanced risk of severe weather from the Ohio Valley to just north of Louisiana. Uh, but a slight risk stretches all the way down to the Gulf Coast. We have a critical fire weather threat today and tomorrow as well. But look at how warm it was in Amarillo, Lubbock, El Paso, Denver. All seeing some uh, 70s and 80s and then even some 80s along the coast. Temperatures running above average in many spots. Uh, still below average, though, from Kansas City to Dallas, uh, where we were anywhere from 10 to almost 30 degrees below average. So critical fire weather concerns in these areas today. Again, very warm, very windy, and also quite dry. So red flag warnings have been posted once again. Winds could be gusting up close to 40, maybe even 50 miles per hour within these areas. We have high wind warnings, wind advisory stretching into the Ohio and Tennessee Valley even, but uh, gusts tomorrow still be, could be quite windy. Some 20 to near 40 mile per hour winds and critical fire weather conditions do continue on our Wednesdays. So uh, still dry and breezy tomorrow. The severe threat, though, does march a little bit farther east. We have enhanced risk from Ohio down to uh, portions of Arkansas and Mississippi. Slight risk, though, from near New Orleans to the Houston-Galveston region. And looking at kind of a later day shower and thunderstorm threat, large hail, damaging winds, even some isolated tornadoes. So keep that in mind as you plan your day and night tonight. There will be pockets of heavy rain, but the overall threat uh, for heavy rain is limited.